DreamWorks The Wild Robot. Very good movie. Another great movie from DreamWorks. Yep. This is really good. I like this movie. I give this movie 9.5 out of 10. It's really good. Directed by Chris Sanders from um, Lilo and Stitch and then uh, How to Train Your Dragon and The Cruise. Now this one. This one's really good. Oh yeah, he did directed um, The Call of the Wild. That was a good movie too. Yep, this is by far one of my favorite movies from DreamWorks. Seriously. Oh yeah. I saw this ad every time and also the trailer every time too. Yep. The Wild Robot. This is my favorite DreamWorks movie ever. My favorite. Based on a book by uh, Peter Brown. I haven't read the book, but the movie is really good. Lupita Nyong'o from uh, Black Panther and also A Quiet Place Day One. That movie is pretty good. I like that movie. Also star included, Pedro Pascal. His next movie next is Gladiator 2. Oh yeah, he did star in Drive Away Dolls. Yep, that's a good one. He also did the ad commercial for um, Corona root beer. Yep, Pedro Pascal is great. I like this guy. Let's see who else we got? Um, Kit Connor. Bill Knighty. I know he starred in the first All Men and now um, he did the voiceover for this movie. I know a while back he did three Simon Peck and Nick Frost movie. That was a long time ago I saw. It's pretty good. Let's see who else. Um, Stephanie Hisu from Everything Everywhere All at Once. And also from the last year movie with Ashley Park, Joyride. And the this year movie with Ryan Gosling, The Fall Guy. That was a good one. Let's see, uh, Matt Berry. Oh, he did the voice as um, Otto from the Garfield movie. That's right. Yep, yeah, that's him. And also he had Mission Impossible with Tom Cruise. Um, Ving Rammies. Yep, he's a great guy. Mark Hanville from Star Wars. The old trilogy of Star Wars and a sequel. Oh yeah, he did the voiceover in the dub English movie for The Boy and the Heron. And also the last year movie with Burt Kreischer, The Machine. Yep, Mark Hanville's great. An actress from... Oh yeah, she in Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Catherine O'Hara. Remember a long time ago, she did the voiceover for two Disney movies? Oh yeah. The Nightmare Before Christmas and um, Elemental. Yep. Catherine O'Hara is great. I know she starred in Home Alone 1 and 2. And also the Apple original film movie, Argyle. Yep. Yeah, this movie's really good. I like this movie. The Wild Robot. And also, I saw the post credit too. That, that was pretty cool too. Good thing I stay after the credit is finished. Yep. This is a great movie for DreamWorks for 2024. Also, you remember last year I saw Ruby Gilman, Teenage Kraken? Oh yeah, I saw that at Century Theater. Oh yeah, remember a while back I saw Kung Fu Panda 4? Oh yeah, that was six months ago when I saw it in Cinemark XD. Yep, that was this year. Same with the DreamWorks The Bad Guys. I saw that movie two years ago in XD. That was pretty good too. Yep, awesome movie. If, if those of you people are looking forward to watching it, do it. It's a great movie. You should enjoy it. And I also hope you're excited for the next year DreamWorks movie, Dog Man. 
Yep, the spin-off of Captain Underpants. Because Dogman by an actor named Pete Davidson. Yep, because that movie's coming January 31st, 2025. Yep. I know Shrek 5 is coming in 2026. We'll have to save that. But first, um, Wicked, that movie's coming out November 22nd in 3D and IMAX. Okay, everybody. You all have a great weekend. And I also hope you enjoy DreamWorks The Wild Robot as well, too.